up you guys it's Momo and today I'm going to be unboxing something that came in the mail that I'm super excited about I'm gonna be unboxing my Ojamajo Toremi Nendroid pre-order that finally came in I have my pink exacto knife and I am ready I think it's <laughs> supposed to be this way all right, so this is the postcard that comes with the usual Ami Ami package. And then if we remove it, we get Doremi Haru... Oh, shit. You get Doremi Harukaze. I love this musical note and... Is that candy? Oh, yeah, in sweets pattern. Okay. Okay, so first things first is the box. We have Doremi Harukaze, and I want to order the rest of the girls, if not all, at least, at least Momo, because I love Momo's character. I don't know if she's my first or second favorite, but my favorite characters are Momo and Doremi. That's the side of the box. You have her flying in her little witch outfit with her little broom. That's her being happy, being the luckiest <laughs> beautiful girl and then here is just what you can do with her just the different poses and she comes with a little majorica which i'm so happy about i believe aiko has hanachan so all right so we're gonna go ahead and get this opened up oh i didn't even notice that it's, i guess their 20th anniversary i don't keep track but oh my god i can't wait to open this up so i'm gonna go ahead and open it and then i will show you guys all right so first off we have the base and the connecting parts right here look at her little feet <laughs> she's so cute okay and then we have her beautiful smile and her confused crying <laughs> and then we have majorica her wand and then her broom and then her oh my god she's so cute all right i'm gonna take her out of there she is so precious. Okay, let me let me take out hold on, let me take her out of the actual thing. Okay, you guys, look at how beautiful this is painted on there. It's like I don't know how to explain it. She's just so like bright and like I don't know, like you can see it on camera, but it looks really also really good in person too. Like <laughs> They did that for her. Oh my god. Look at her cute little dress. I love this. I'm so happy they did this. We just need a Tokyo Mew Mew one now. <laughs> if I flip her over. That's so cute. I love her hat. How bulky it is. I don't know if you can see that. That's really cool. I always loved this part of her hair. And her cute little musical note. I'm gonna go ahead and switch her faces and put her in some of the poses. So I'll be back. Okay, wait, so before I do that, look at the inside of the actual box. I never even noticed that. But it's all pink and it has this cute lace pattern. I love that. All right, I'll be back. So right off the bat, I'm having trouble putting this on. I'm trying to put arms so she's holding her wand but it's not working because I guess her shoulder joint won't connect. I don't know how to else explain it, but I'll show you. All right, so what I have to do is I need to take this part and put it on her, but it won't fit and it's getting stuck. And yes, before you ask me, I am using the instructions right there. So I don't want to force it in because I know I'll break it like I've broken ones before. So I'm just going to do a different pose that doesn't require that much pressure or force. Um, and yeah, and I'll show you guys in a bit. Okay, so this is the pose that I have her in right now with her wand. And I wanted her to have her wand in and everything um, in a different pose. But it was really hard to put the joints in. For all the poses, even this one, I thought maybe if I tried an easier one, it would be easier. Um, but it actually wasn't. It was really hard. You had to like force the joints in, which 
really scared me because I'm like traumatized from that K on Nendroid that I broke. And then I did keep Majorica in there, but it's really like weird the way you put her in because she's on a slant, so she looks weird no matter what way you put her in. I finally managed to like make her look somewhat okay in that pose. So yeah, and basically other than the fact that the joints were really hard to put in, I actually really love this Nendroid and I do think it's worth it. I don't know, I think she's so cute and so bright. I might change the pose later, but that's what I have right now and I really wanna get the other girls. And of course, there are plenty of other, I have like the whole freaking works here of what you can do with her. I did wanna have her with her broom, but I was just, too scared because the broom and um the wand are actually pretty thin and fragile but yeah that's what i have right now thank you guys so much for watching let me know what you think do you think she looks good do you want one did you get you your own please check out my social media in the description below and also of course please don't forget to check out my shop i have a bunch of cute things on there as well as new items and of course there's gonna be new items coming soon as always. Thank you guys again and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!